All right, Mandy, it's time for another podkins. And actually, we have a great giveaway this episode, don't we? We do. This was actually part of a whole social media giveaway where we gave away these cute spring buddies on our social media channels and on Webkins News. So here's a chance to get one more. And yeah, the code awards one of these three adorable spring buddies. Yes, they are so cute. The flower one is common. The rainbow is uncommon. And it's tricky to unlock that little chick there because they are rare so you never know what you're going to get but stay tuned for the code that we'll be giving out at the end of the episode mandy today we're going to talk about our may events on webkins classic there's a lot going on throughout the month yeah may is one of my favorites because i always love the flower collection prizes and this month they're indoor this time for a change and they're really pretty yeah, we're going to jump on my account and I'll show you those prizes shortly. I should say, actually, we just finished a deluxe preview week and that started on Webkin's Day on April 29th and it ended on Friday. But uh, Mandy, right now we're in the middle of a DIY divider event which is really exciting. It is. I think players are excited about this. I know because they are the coolest, coolest things. They're those dividers, right? That you can do yeah. and paint. And they're so great. I love them for dividing up your space. They're such a great addition to even the plain one without the wall paint is great. They work yeah. so well. No, they're great. And starting on the 11th, we have an underwater ruins clubhouse room. And on the 15th, we have a garden center clubhouse room. So we've got a couple of clubhouse rooms being released in May for a limited amount of time. And then at the end of the month, we have a couple of challenges as well. There's a checkers challenge and a wackier zingos challenge for wacky weekend. But we'll talk about these events in more detail in just a bit. I should say, though, I mentioned that there was a deluxe preview week that took place. That went until May 5th. So free and full players actually had the chance to complete the May Deluxe Challenge if they logged in during that week. And the prize for that was actually a really cool neon bowling alley. And 50-ish Webbies used three of them in their room design here, which is a cosmic bowling alley, which I thought was really neat. Yeah, that is a beautiful, beautiful. The colors are so vibrant in that. And uh, they did a great job. Yeah, I love those screens in the back. There are two of those like sort of... LED screens or something. They are from the Rockers Backstage Passes. So oh, there you go. Work perfectly here. What a great oh, yeah. combination. They really captured like the feel almost of like a, a bowling alley, you know, in a center where there'd be lots of people and lots of activity and noise going on. You yeah. really feel that. Really neat. I should mention as well that uh, when Goober became mayor, he promised to add a new prize to the Wheel of Wow every time we updated Webkin's Classic. And our next update is actually on May 10th. And so the prize that Goober's added this time around is this really cool sign-up sheet. So the idea is that this is a sign-up sheet that you would find maybe in the Kinsville Academy. Maybe you'd be signing up for to audition in a play or join a sports team. But I thought this was really neat neat so you can get that starting on may 10th yeah i can see that with loads of different applications there's so many campkins or oh, yeah. i think people are gonna love that i love wall items like that really neat. yeah Items. They add so much to a room. No, absolutely. And by the time this podcast is released, the sign-up sheet will probably be available. But um, previously to that, um, Goober had added the gaming chair to the Wheel of Wow. I was able to win one by spinning the Wheel of Wow. By the way, you can earn Goober's prizes by spinning the Wheel of Wow on the Webkins desktop app and the Webkins mobile app. So if you play both, you have two chances to win one every day, which is pretty cool. But uh, now, Mandy, why don't we jump on to my my account and we can sneak peek some of the prizes that you can win during these events. Cool. The inside scoop. All right, Mandy. Oh, look, there's a floaty clicky for okay. the DIY divider event. That, of course, runs until May 16th. Which one did I get? You can get three different types of wall paint. This one looks like the wow, cafe it? one. Oh, 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 nice. Okay, yeah, yeah. I put my eyes. <laughs> I can show you how to make wall dividers in a sec. We went over that during a previous podcast, but I wanted to show you this. This is a bathroom that I created using the prizes from this year's Marshmallow Collection event. Yeah, and you know what, guys? This is such a pretty, fresh bathroom, and you should all watch Webkin's News later this week because there is going to be a printable Mother's Day card 
Oh, right. Yeah, you're going to want to use it with the this lovely bathroom. So, you know what? Check Webkin's news to see the code because there's actually a code for Webkin's Next and Webkin's Classic, and you can get a prize in each. But, yeah, so cute. Such fresh, bright colors, the green with the pinks and purples. I love those combinations of colors. Yeah, they're beautiful. So there's the wallpaper here. You can get the toilet, the, the shower, the sink, and the little bath mat, which is great. Bath mat will work in a lot of places, too. Like, I know, I mean, obviously, the shower and sink, obviously, are for a bathroom. But the wallpaper and the bath mat, I think people will probably use for lots of different rooms. For sure. And so the way that you collect flowers is you have to visit your Kinzel map. You can get there using the things to do menu. You'll see a little flower collection icon. This is only available on the Webkin's desktop app, by the way. But when you click on the icon, um, you'll just pop up this interface that shows you all of the five prizes. You'll also actually earn two free flowers a day just by clicking on the icon if you're a deluxe player. One, if you're free or full, there are the prizes here, that the grand prize, the wallpaper. It'll show your progress here. So I've only collected six of 50. This is a test account. So we only use this to show off sort of sneak peek to various events on Webkin's Classic. When you click your Ask Friends button here, you can click on the, the friends and your friends list that you want to send a request to. They'll receive it in their message center. And, you know, if you're lucky, they'll send you some flowers to earn towards your collection. Yeah, this event runs throughout May. So there's lots of time, but don't leave it to the last minute because of course you need 50 to unlock the grand prize. But Mandy, the cool thing about these events is that uh, you can play them more than one, right? Yeah, that is what I love about collection events is that if you ask your friends every day go on and ask your friends and collect all the opportunities then when you've collected all 50 you can start right over again and you can do it again so you can collect multiples and of course these are great prizes to have multiples of so i am definitely going to try and collect at least one set and do more so really yeah nice. I just, I especially love that wallpaper. I could see it being used in the kitchen, maybe. Yeah, like there's no limit to what you can do. As I said, with that bath mat and with the wallpaper, then you're not limited to a bathroom, obviously, and stick a shower wherever you want. (laughs) (laughs) Exactly. Really nice stuff. Really, really fresh. Just fresh spring. They put me in the mood for spring, and, and maybe it's finally starting to warm up a bit here. So, yeah fun and fresh for spring so by the time this podcast is released it will likely be that um, the new prizes have been released in jumbleberry fields so we're releasing six new prizes in jumbleberry fields and of course you can earn a prize every single time you fill up a jar of preserves and i just wanted to show you the new prizes of course we retired the pickleberry bumper car we announced that several weeks ago on webkins news so hopefully you were able to to trade a jar of pickleberry relish for one of those bumper cars before they were removed. But I love this. These are two new ones in the Jumbleberry prizes. It's a Jumbleberry jam poster you can hang up on your pet's room. And we also have berry farm overalls, which are really Yeah, I like the sort of natural tone of those work overalls. You can sort of imagine that twill fabric right that those overalls come in and also yeah like i always you know that the jumbleberry prize are some of my favorites because it's that rustic feel so i'm so excited that they're new prizes yeah so the pickleberry prize was the only one that we retired this time around i'll show you the new sugarberry prizes as well we have this berry farm cap which matches the overalls and we also have this great jumbleberry fields lunchbox that you can use to store food Nice. Yeah, so maybe you can store some of your berries in there if you'd like to keep them as souvenirs. But of course, all the other sugarberry prizes are also available. I mentioned that that pickleberry bumper car was retired, but that was in order to make room for this awesome berry farm windmill, which I love. Yeah, and it's very yeah. cool. You can add it to your room. It's animated. It's great for That's all of your great. farm room designs. Yeah, and the final one is a Moonberry prize, which I think is great. We released this uh, Jumbleberry Fields billboard that you can display in your room. Really cool. They're such nice prizes. And yeah, it's so rewarding too, because you have to work hard to get these prizes, right? Like save up your berries and yeah. uh, 
And yet it's so satisfying when you finally fill a jar and you can trade them in. I love this billboard as well because, you know, we have those street tiles that you can get in the decoration section of the W shop. Yeah, you can put together maybe like a, a little highway room design and an outdoor room and, and display this billboard along the side of the highway, which is pretty cool. But Mandy, you said it's tough to collect berries, but in June, actually, every year we run a berry fest and you can get bonus plays of Jumbleberry Fields every day and also collect floating berries. So that helps you fill up your jar faster as well. Yeah, and when I say it's tough, it's not that tough because Jumbleberry Fields is one of my favorite games. So it's a good excuse to play. I just mean it takes a I, I love playing Jumbleberry Fields. So the added incentive of getting those prizes after you've really worked hard at it is awesome. I like Jumbleberry Fields as well. That's what Diner Dice on Webkin's Next. That's one of my favorite games to play at the arcade because it's, it's similar to the game. You don't earn prizes at the end or berries, but the gameplay is very similar. Yeah, it's sort of the same idea. These are great prizes, so I'm sure players are going to love collecting these. Yeah, and I mentioned earlier that we would be releasing two clubhouse rooms for a limited time in May. And Manny, the first one is the Underwater Ruins Room, right? Which is available from May 11th to 31st. The Underwater Ruins is this great new theme. Now, the Angel Fish is a new pet and i don't think we've released a fish for a little while so it's very exciting that we've got a new fish pet and then uh its theme you know how the pet sort of some of them the first of the month pet has a theme that sort of goes with it so the underwater ruins theme came along at the same time as the angel fish so we decided to have a clubhouse room that showcases both of them and yeah it's a cute pet it gives away a sort of uh underwater treasure prizes it's like he's found some booty and he's going to share with you i know you can't remember offhand exactly what they all are i know there were some pieces of coral some rock you got a chance at those king's cash floor tiles nice some of the, the prizes that you can win from the angelfish are displayed in this room, right? Like these, yeah, they're they're great. They, and these prizes have never been released before. Some of them, the decorative pieces of coral that you can display. So, so there you go. There's the angelfish sitting on the rock there. And when you click on them, you'll receive a little gift box. We can go back to my room, drag it in to see what we win shortly. Let me just switch over to the garden center room. This room is available from May 15th to 25th, and uh, it features one of our newest hosts, right, Mandy? Holly Hopper. Yeah, of course. Holly Hopper is our community organizer. And you might have just uh, met Holly for the Webkin's Day Challenge that happened in Next. And right now she's visiting Classic where she's uh, running this cute little garden center. It's very colorful and lots of cool plants. Yeah, and actually there are seven prizes that you can win and one of them actually has never been released before. It's brand new to the game and it's a pack of growing garden blueberry seeds that you can plant in your room. So I'm going to try to get those now. The growing garden seeds are really great because they, they look great. They dispense uh, blueberry for your pet. So they're awesome prizes. Yeah, so there's Holly Hopper. I'm just going to click on her and... There are blackberry seeds, there are blueberry seeds, and there are a few other garden decorations. I'll, I'll show you that in a sec, but I just got another can of wall paint. Let me remind you guys how to use that. You can go in the W shop to the fun stuff section, look in the DIY section of the shop and you'll see wall paints. You can use these wall paints to color a divider at any point, but we have special wall paint that are only available during our DIY divider event. Our first one is being held from May 6th to 13th. Um, and when you click on them, you can, you can get one of those three special cans of wall paint. And when you combine them with the design ticket, which is available in this section of the W shop and a divider, now, the design tickets and the dividers, again, are always available in the W shop, as are the wall paint, just those three special wall paints are only available during the event. But when you combine the ticket and the divider with the wall paint at the Kin style outlet, you'll make a divider that you can add to your pet's room. I love this great. item. It's so handy. Yes. So I'm going to click on the clothing machine here, clothing machine button. I'm going to go to my new tab because I just bought the divider and the design ticket. And let me drag in that can of cafe wall paint that I won during the event. I click the make it button and the divider will appear in my dock. Nice. And I love this cafe one. 
Yeah, I love all those, the ones that do the wallpaper paint. I'm so thrilled at this new uh, divider. I, I feel like it's going to have so many great uses. Oh, absolutely. Actually, someone left a comment on Webkin's News saying that the cafe divider would be used in a lot of gardens. And I think, yeah, that's yeah. a great idea. For it. Yeah, definitely. That's a great idea. So let me just jump to a different room here. I've actually planted some blueberry seeds in this room. They have yet to grow though, but that's okay. I'll show you the divider here that I just made at the Kinsella outlet. There you go. Nice. Looks nice. That yeah. Looks now I said that we were having a wacky weekend during the end of the month. It runs from May 26th to 28th. And during that event, there's a Wackier Zingos challenge. And if you manage to complete the challenge in three days, you're actually awarded this awesome wacky geyser, which is really cool. Those geysers are featured in the game Wackier Zingos. And we have released this before in the past during a previous Wackier Zingo challenge event. But hey, you can never have enough wacky geysers. Mandy, the final thing that I just wanted to show off sneak peek because I just have it in room is, you know, every month we've been doing these W shop challenges where you can complete tasks to earn a sort of companion prize to one of the themes in the W shop. And so the June W shop challenge, if you manage to complete that, you win this condo balcony, which works with the condo wallpaper. And Eric, our technical artist, did such a great job here by having the pet actually walk inside and jump on the chair outside of the balcony. Oh, um, it's a great item. It's the, It reminds me a bit of like our great showers that pets can go into. It's so neat the way your pets can interact with this balcony. Absolutely. This is the condo balcony here that it matches, but it matches uh, the, the green tone here matches all the greens featured throughout all the furniture in this theme. It's available in the W shop and really it's meant to go indoors. This is kind of an outdoor scene, but I just added it here because I was really excited how this worked and how the pet actually jumps and sits on, on their lounge chair there. Yeah, that was a special sneak peek, but there's a lot going on throughout May, Mandy. I'm really happy that you're here to uh, sneak peek all these prizes and upcoming events. All right, there you go. So much happening throughout May on Webkin's Classic and Webkin's Next. Of course, check Webkin's News regularly to learn more about all these events on both sites. If you haven't been on Next recently, we just started a new season, the Radiant Rainbow season. Really bright, colorful, cool prizes, great grand prize. So uh, definitely go and check out the new season in Webkin's Next. And we'll have Sally on soon to uh, <laughs> about more Next, right? Oh, Oh, for sure. And actually, we recently released trading on Webkin's Next as well. And actually, our last podcast episode was all about trading on Webkin's Next. So click the link below to check that episode out. Yeah. And you know what? On our YouTube channel, too, Sally just did a trading how to video. So definitely check out our last podkins but also go check out sally's video on youtube because it shows how to trade in a little more debt oh nice there you go um youtube.com forward slash webkins here is a look mandy we just saw that garden center clubhouse room these are the seven prizes that you can win i really love that potting bench right there on the right yeah, it's a flat surface. You can add items onto there. So maybe if you had flower pots, you can add them on there. There's a look at those blueberry growing garden seeds. They're brand new to this event. So you can only get them from May 15th to 25th when you click on Holly Hopper at the Garden Center Room. Play every day, though, for the chance to collect all of these prizes because they are random every day. You, you never know what you're going to get. But Mandy, as promised, why don't we give away a code for one of these spring buddies? This is also randomized. But of course, there's the common flower, the uncommon rainbow, and the rare chick. So when you unlock this at the code shop, let us know in the comment section below which one you unlocked. Okay. So the code for this is W24H6QFYG72F R B nine W and that code expires on July 31st, 2023 at midnight EST. So be sure to enter it in the code shop in Webkin's classic by that date. Cause you don't want to miss your chance. Yes. And Mandy, are you going to be giving away more of these codes on social media or have they all been given away already? Uh, you know what? We'll probably do one on TikTok too. Actually. Okay. So there you yeah. go. If people want, they can go and check Webkin's News and they can check our social media channels because 
The codes are still there. And again, those will be valid until the end of July too. So if you miss that event, you can go back and look now and find them. There you go. So go to the recent news tab on Webkin's News to scroll back and look at older articles. You can also feel free to email us at podkins at gans.com. And Mandy, you mentioned before, Sally just posted a great tutorial on our YouTube channel, youtube.com slash Webkin's, but we have lots of content there, right? Yeah. You know what? Our YouTube channel is such a good resource. They We did a whole bunch of how-to videos when we released Next, and we're, we're continuing to update those. But also there's like our old podkins. And of course, you can check our old podkins for codes too, right? Because we give away codes all the time. And if they haven't expired, that's another chance. So yeah, definitely check out our YouTube channel and subscribe because that way you know that you will never miss one. Awesome. Thank you so much again, Mandy, for hosting with me. Um, So much fun. Thank you guys for playing and thank you guys for watching. And who knows, maybe we'll run into you in Kinsville. Bye, guys. Thanks, Michael. Bye.